From Aaron, my 10-year-old wants to know, how did all matter exist before the Big Bang? Oh, okay. So there's a whole chapter on that. Read the damn book. Okay, go. <laughs> well, there's that's about yeah, as that's quick. How you that's plug. a quick answer, buddy. That's a quick answer. There you go. Because there's a whole chapter on how did it all begin, and no, I'll, I'll address it just briefly. Okay, so you're thinking of matter like it's a thing, but matter and energy is, is a thing. Okay, and so you can. So there's a limit to how much you can cram matter while it stays matter. But above a certain pressures and temperatures, it becomes pure energy. You cram that into a tiny, tiniest volume ever. Now you want to know what was around before we had that concentration of energy that then birthed the universe, later also becoming matter. And there are ways we have come to understand that. And that's what gave birth to the concept of the multiverse. Because the, the energy infusion that makes one universe... There's no reason to think it wouldn't make an infinite number of universes, and that's the multiverse. And these are universes with, and by the way, there are universes that have the same laws of physics. So you could be there having a conversation just like here, all right, that you're twin. You wouldn't know it, but they'd be there. There are other universes where the universes would have slightly different laws of physics. Those would be really dangerous to visit. You want to, like, flip a coin across that proscenium see what happens to it if it if it decomposes and it melts or it, it, it vap the vapor whatever just then don't go right because you're you are you exist in this universe in a form that is exquisitely enabled by the laws of physics that you evolved in and the creatures in the other universe who the hell knows what they look like hollywood is yet to to go there by the way to go to a multiverse with different laws of physics um in a sci-fi story so Anyone out there in this audience who's got the chops to write such a story, go for it. <laughs>